Hello, my name is Anne and welcome to a Toganet Quilty Fun episode 15. If you are new to my channel, welcome and oh my gosh, I have got such a lot of new subscribers this past week. Thank you so much for giving me a chance to show you all my crafty stuff. Um, so if you don't know how the channel works, on Mondays I talk about my knitting on Wednesdays, it's all about the cross stitch. And on Fridays, it's about the quilting. Quilting is kind of new for me. I started it um, about two years ago when the you know what started. And um, I'm really, really enjoying it a lot. So let me get on and tell you what I've been working on this past week, which hasn't been a great deal only because I'm in the process of moving my craft room from a spare room upstairs down to my huge basement. So I'm gonna have a really big craft room slash grandson's playroom. Um, and it, we have to redecorate as we're going. We had a big bar that we had to take out all apart because my son's getting that. And then there was all these holes in the walls how we had to fill out and stuff and Anyway, uh, long story short, it's taking longer than I, the impatient one, had anticipated. And um, so I'm kind of all over the place trying to record, find a spot in the house that's not full of dust or <laughs> tripping over paint cans and stuff. And I actually don't uh, even have a, my sewing machines put away for the moment because it's like, ah. anyway. Uh, <laughs> of chaos but I have done a little bit so here's what I did do so last week I told you about um, the beautiful day mystery block of the month by Kari Yoda and um, that is over on her website and uh, YouTube channel and each month for the next six months she's doing this mystery block using her beautiful day fabric which is beautiful and she is going, and you have to do four blocks for each, well, at the moment you do, um, for each, it's the same block, but you have to do it four times in each of the, th anyway, I'm waffling. And we are using a panel, because Beautiful Day comes with a panel, and we're using the panel as the centerpiece. So the first block was the Sawtooth Star, which I love. And these are big blocks. They're 16 by 16 inches. So I am loving this. So I have done that one. And this one. Isn't that pretty? And in some cases, I didn't have all the fabrics from that line. And this one. <clears throat> I really like this one. I think it looks lovely with the green panel in the middle. So what I did was I, if you go back and look at last week's video, um, there is a little, uh, like a sheet she, you, you can print out with all the blocks you'll need and the colors. And I just made a little color swatch myself and changed some of them up. So for example, this actually is from another line altogether but it still matches beautifully. So um, I love it. There's one more I have to make and I'm actually doing that um, as a video for you next week um, when I'm away. So you'll get to see how I actually put together those blocks. So that'll be ready for you for next week. Um, the other thing I wanted to show you <clears throat> is um the bright side quilt along which um so each month in the so sample box we get a card now you can purchase this the card um at the fat quarter shop i think it's 4.99 the pat well, i should say the patent not the card um and it shows you how to make a block so this is the block it's going to show you how to make and at the end of the month, so this is block 10, at the end, we will put them all together. I think it goes to 12 
or 12 might be the finishing instructions to put it together as a quilt. Um, so this is my block for block 10, which is really very pretty. Yeah, I like that one a lot. And I've been using the Beautiful Day fabric from um, A Quilting Life, which is Sherry McConnell. I just tried to think for a minute then. <clears throat> Isn't that pretty? Little dots on it there. And, and I did starch this fabric so you can see it's nice and stiff. And again, it's not giving me many... Um, oh, there's a train going by. So they come every month. So that was last month because I was trying to catch up before the latest box came. So let me show you what's in this box. This box is titled Home Sweet Nest. And I'm just going to jump right in and show you the pattern first. The pattern comes in the box and it's exclusive to the Fat Quarter Shop uh, so sample a box. Now I love getting this box for two reasons. Number one, I think it's quite cheap. It's $26 US, so it turns out to be about between $34 and $36 Canadian, because I'm in Canada, um, with the shipping included. And um, you get fabric. It's usually um, fat quarters, a jelly roll, a layer cake, um, something like that. So for a new quilter like myself, it was great to try out all the small cuts of fabric and figure out what you do with them. And then it comes with some notions as well, which again are so very useful. Um, but the, you can buy all the stuff that's in this box on their website if you see it and think, oh, I didn't subscribe that month, but I really like that fabric or I really like that whatever. The only thing you cannot get is the pattern because the pattern is exclusive. Would you look at that? Would you look at that? Look at those little birds. I absolutely love that. I'm definitely gonna make this. And let me show you the fabric next because it's beautiful. It's called Kitchen Witchin, Kitchen Witchin, <laughs> Kitchen Window Woven. Let's try saying that three times with a gum in your mouth. Kitchen Window Window Wovens by Elizabeth Hartman. And look at these beautiful fat quarters. It's really hard to show you this way, but you can see them. They are all this lovely woven gingham, all the different colors. Twelve. Actually, they're not fat quarters, they're fat eighths. So a fat eighth is half of a fat quarter. So, um... These are super cute. So there's 12, 12. I mean, this alone is worth 20 odd dollars. So you, everything else is basically free. Um, you get a little card that tells you, actually, let's have a look and see how much that was. Does it say, oh, it's valued at 18.98. So that's a good deal. We've got our new block. For, this is block 11 so that will be the new one to do and that is worth $4.98 if you were to buy it on the shop then we've got these oh clipper binds so these are to do your bindings on your quilt and it's kind of like a wonder clip but I feel like they're a bit bigger they look a little bit bigger to me than a wonder clip. So there's a packet of them. And they are valued at $8.98. Then there's this, which is a So Steady Beeswax. So if you're hand stitching, you run um, the thread through the beeswax. 
and uh, it's supposed to help. Never tried that, so that's interesting. What's that valued at? Seven dollars. And then lastly, it's this little thing, which I haven't opened yet, but I'm going to because I've been dying to see what's in this. Machine cleaning brushes. And they are cute. And I think they're like a silicone. So they'll definitely pick up the, um, the lint and stuff that you get, you know, around the housing of the, so this was this month's box. So this was the February box because they're still a little tiny bit behind with their shipping. And that was about, they valued at 250. So you get a really good value in the box, I think. And uh, so I'll be making that when I come back from <clears throat> Vegas. I'm so excited to go. Um, okay, so what else? So two other things I do want to talk to you about before I go. So yeah, I didn't do much sewing this week, but as you can tell why. And of course, there'll be no sewing next week because I'll be in Vegas. Um, but two things to tell you. So do you remember there is a Missouri Star Quilt Company, who are a US company. They normally put out a big Christmas box each year for Advent. So you buy it ahead of time. And I think they ship in November. So you get it before the 1st of December. And then each day you open a gift that's to do with quilting. It could be um, rulers, it could be fabric, it could be a pattern, it could be just something funny like a mug or something to put in your craft room while you're sewing. And they're pretty expensive, but they're also there from the US. So one of my favorite quilt shops here in Canada, I'm in Ontario, is um, Water Girl Quilt Company in Prescott, Ontario. And they have this year decided they're going to do a Christmas box for us quilty crafters. And everything inside of this box will be Canadian. Sourced Canadian. And I have no idea what's gonna be in it. And I'm not sponsored by them at all, but I've definitely ordered one. And I think it's like 200 and $30, I want to say, and that includes your shipping, I think. And you can either pick it up or they'll ship it to you. And I'm pretty sure she said the shipping was free or included. I'm not sure. Um, you pay a $30 deposit now. And I think it, I don't remember the date you have to do it by. I feel like it's, I forget the date. I'm, I'll put a link below and, uh, it might even be on this little picture that I'm gonna slide in. Um, and then you can pay $50 um, a month for the next four months, something like that. Or you can pay for the whole thing out front. Um, I'm doing the monthly payments. And uh, so I'm really excited for that because I love doing an advent every, and of course I'll open it up for you guys to see that don't get it so, so you can see what was in it. And that'll be a lot of fun. So that'll be coming in December. And the other thing I wanted to tell you about is the, as you all know, I am now an ambassador for the spring mystery kit from Cotton Cuts. Um, and the way this is going to work is they are sending me a kit. It's a mystery. And there are four or five or six colorways that you get to choose from and um, they will send me a colorway and we will be making something. Uh, I don't believe it's as big as a quilt because it's not like the monthly one I have been doing with the Dorothy quilt that I've been working on. <clears throat> um, the Olympia um, quilt, mystery quilt, which is, I think we're getting to clue nine, waiting for clue nine to get here because I think clue 10 is the end and that's when we get the finishing for it. So I'm still waiting for my clue nine. It hasn't arrived in Canada yet. I think they've all got it in the US, but Canada is a little bit slower. Um, and so um, this other one, the spring mystery kit is a smaller version 
it's probably a table runner or a, a wall hanging. It's something small that we can do in one go, basically. And they release the clues every other day. So, and everything comes in the one package for you. <clears throat> all your fabric, everything. And it's all pre Let me say that again, pre-cut. And I understand it's coming with thread. So all you have to do is sit down, thread your machine, get your stuff, get your clue, make it. So I thought that would be super fun to do that with you. And any other Canadians who tend to get theirs late, if, if any of the Canadian watchers have ordered the spring Cotton Cuts Mystery. So um, I'm going to start my videos on, I'm gonna add two extra videos in for you the week I'm back from Vegas. So on the Tuesday, the 26th, and Thursday, the 28th, I am going to start the videos and they will be over three weeks. So we will end up with a finished item in the three weeks and I will open the the clues with you each time. So I'm not even gonna cheat and look, I'm gonna do it with you and we'll see and we'll make it together. You can watch me do it. So I think it's gonna be super fun. I have tasked both my sons to help find me some better cameras to use other than my iPhone <laughs> and um, some mics and lights and stuff like that so I can try to make the viewing for you much nicer. Um, but anyway, so we're gonna see how that works. I think it's gonna be a lot of fun and I'm very excited for that. So anyway, that's all I have for you today, not much, um, but I hope you have enjoyed the video. Please like and subscribe and tell your mates. And I will see you next Friday for a very special Quilty Fun, or Monday for some knitting. See you then. Bye.